Morning everyone. I uh, want to give you a quick update uh, where we are with the RV rebuild. We've been on a little break as you probably saw from the last video so uh, we are getting back to it now. So <clears throat> okay let's start from the front. So Layla's bed not really going with that yet. We we'll still need to do some work over here. We know we've had a previous damp issue there but it's not wet at the moment so somebody's probably repaired that in the past but it does need dealing with because the wood's not great okay let's come round okay <clears throat> so ignore the mess um, down here we've got some some uh, side they are there so example wire there so some side marker lights going in we've got to wire them in I'm going to do that today hopefully uh, and they'll get wired in um, we've started to lay some uh, base floor um, so we're going to have some uh, laminate or similar over the top of, of the top of this this is 18 mil thick we don't really need to worry too much about the weight because uh, of the size of the vehicle but that's nice and solid now that's lovely uh, that's just blanked off with a vent on the outside that did have the what was there oh that was the battery box for the generator uh, previously so that's now just blanked off with a with a, a grill that we uh, use from somewhere else on the van okay let's go back over this side <clears throat> okay so this area here let's step back a bit so this area here is going to be the yes the fridge is going here little mini fridge then we're gonna have a shelf on the top a worktop and then uh, we're not sure about up here yet, maybe some uh, cupboard or something. So this will be a little uh, working surface for, for Samantha. A um, bit of an extension to the kitchen if you like. The next door is going to be a really nice big shower. So that's set out now, the frame size. Okay, let's get over here. Yep, there we go. Lovely big shower there. That piece of wood's just loose on the bottom at the minute. We're just wondering how big a step we need there to uh, keep the uh, shower water inside. So all this is going to be ply boarded out. And then it's going to be completely glass uh, glassed over. Fiberglass uh, and fiberglass resin. That's going to be completely glassed in. Uh, be a solid uh, waterproof box. Rob is building in here... Um, uh, a gradient a plug hole is going to go over here somewhere we think so we're putting our own built building our own gradient in here so we've got enough slope if we park in a slightly uneven pitch that kind of thing um, and we need to deal with how we're going to get that uh, water away with some kind of shallow u-bend it has to really be really shallow <laughs> we're struggling at the minute but we'll, we'll find something okay then next this area is going to be the sofa area, seating area, round here, all the way around, round here. Okay, so sort of a big C shape, if you like. Um, underneath here is going to be the water tank, the fresh water tank. Pump somewhere here, close to the shower, so we can keep maximum pressure. Um, all this has got to be insulated out. Need to sort this wiring out next week. Um, a lot of this is redundant. Uh, all we need, all we need here from the old wiring, is the wiring for the the motor vehicle lighting circuit, uh, the lighting circuit. So um, we'll sort out what we need, what we don't. Uh, probably on Monday. Starting to put a bit of a structure in here because that's really weak back here. Um, <clears throat> uh a little we're gonna have a little shelf area here and we think this area here if you like is going to be a vertical so everything there will be contained any wires in there will be contained in that uh bit of a section there um what else have we got oh yeah we've put some wires in the top for the um uh for the the top marker lights we've got seven marker lights across the top red marker lights Okay, so yep, seating comes round here. Uh, 
we're gonna where this is where the generator was so we're gonna have and that sinks into the floor slightly if you remember from a previous previous video so we're gonna have um, a little uh, garage little box area underneath the seating just there and then uh, around here that's got to be blanked off somehow I'm not sure what we're doing with that we're gonna keep that water point but we won't use it we just leave it on the van uh, this area here is going to be the toilet <coughs> um yep nice big area that is plenty of room probably going to put something on the on the wall a little cupboard or something as you know we've got our roof lights in now and then let's step back over this way and then from here through to here somewhere where the, where this floor ends but the floor is going to continue on uh that is going to be the kitchen area um we've got what we've we got in there so far we've got a cooker oven we've got a hob still got to get the sink because it got the last one got held up in customs from china or whatever and uh, never got here <laughs> so still got to get a sink and then then figure out how we're going to do the units are we going to make them are we going to buy them we're not sure yet uh, and then here is going to be the uh King size double bed, king size double bed right here. Uh, so this floor is going to continue on because we've certainly got enough of it that we bought to, to finish that. So we, we are going to continue to lay that over there. And then all the electric work is going to go over this side, over this side. Um, so all the, sort of the solar is all going to come down the wall. In fact, we started to channel it out. That's all going to go in here. Uh, a couple of leisure batteries, inverter, um, a consumer unit. That, that's all going down there. Uh, and, and of course, then the bed, of course, is next to the, the seating area, which is different to the way a lot of people do it. But that's the way we want to do it, because we've got this nice big window here, as we mentioned in the previous video. Right. OK, so uh, we'll leave that there, guys. Just a little update for you as to how we're getting on and we'll get another video out uh, later this week for you. Okay, love you loads guys. Give us a big thumbs up. Take care. Bye-bye.